As a little girl, I used to sit on the step and crush petals together. You know, just really trying to squeeze from them every drop of fragrance available. Now I have the chance of making that fragrance come true and it's just a wonderful opportunity. I became inspired to become a florist because I just discovered how wonderful, as a child even, I discovered how fantastic flowers can look and, um, and be and smell. And it was just wonderful, I think, just that discovery of, of just those senses. Flowers are special to me because I've worked with them for, from about the age of um, 16 and from day one when I worked with them I just thought they were just so fantastic. Um, even then they weren't that exciting, the blooms that you saw were not that wonderful but now there are just so many available that you can't help but be bowled over with them. The inspiration behind my fragrance bottles came from my love of minimalist concepts, which for me is represented by the elegant black tulip. So I decided to recreate this for my new fragrance bottle, a tall elegant stem and a black tulip bud. Alongside the fragrances, I've created foaming bath milks and luxurious body creams using the same floral notes. Iris, jasmine and sandalwood make the most beautiful perfume. It's incredible actually how it just mixes together and makes this soft fragrance that is just lovely to wear. Now this next fragrance I love, I love it and it's so exciting with its ingredients. There are red roses in it which everyone could say well they're not that exciting but the variety that we've used with the fragrance is so gorgeous. We've used black violets which you know, I just love the, th the very sound of those and the thought of using those as well is marvellous. And cyclamen. So there in all, we've got three fabulous ingredients. Fruit and flowers have been thought of as an odd ingredient um, to put together. But if it's done in the right way, fabulous. This one is fig, amber and sandalwood and to me it's very passionate, dark, the chemistry of it works really well. Now this next fragrance I find is absolutely gorgeous. I know I'm saying that about them all but I really love this one. It's gardenia, it's cedarwood and it's patchouli, which is a particular love of mine. Um, and mixed together, there's a soft ingredient, there's a, you know, there's a harsher patchouli, but it's, it's special. That's the only thing I can say about it. It is very, very special, so please try it. Green orchid Vetiver and lemongrass are one of my favourite concoctions. Now, it's sharp, it's um, 
but it's also soft. You know, there's something about it that when you put all the ingredients together, they just really work. had this passion for flowers and um, the actual scents of the flowers. Uh, ever since I was 15, that's when I first started to work with flowers, um, it's, it's just got a hold of me, it's got a grip of me. 